Hey, what's up guys? This is Linus here with iOS Sherbrickson, bringing you guys another episode of Top Tweaks of the Week. Now, this week we've got quite some amazing tweaks, um, so let's just jump into this. Alright, so first up we have Ira, or Aira, um, it's spelled A-Y-R-A. The name will be um, on the left top left hand corner, so you can check it out. Uh, it's a pretty amazing tweak. It pretty much lets you... Um, uh, open up your notification center inside of your lock screen and it does also give you all these toggles at the top um, Currently, I don't have any notifications, so um, uh, I can't actually see any of them But as you can see it does have quite a lot of toggles and it does look a lot like iOS 7 in addition you also do get um, This really cool slider. It's um, semi-transparent. I'd say uh, it does also have the camera grabber, which is also um, transparent uh, at least a little bit and uh, if we uh, just slide from the top as you can see we can access all our toggles it has lots of toggles you can pretty much rearrange these toggles uh, using the settings application and um, just to show you how this all works um, as you can see it works pretty smooth uh, I'll just turn on airplane mode and turn that off once again and as you can see it runs quite smooth and that's pretty much it for this tweak alright guys now let's go to the next tweak Alright, so next up we have Search Amplius or Search Amplius. Um, I don't know how to say it, but what it does is it pretty much lets you search uh, on YouTube, uh, the App Store, Cydia, and, uh, uh, and a few other places actually. Uh, let me just search for iOS Jailbreak Zone using my Spotlight Search. As you can see, it is taking a, a bit of time, but that's probably because I do have a lot of other uh, different tweaks installed. But as you can see, it did work, and um, uh, once I searched for iOS Jailbreak Zone, it appeared with, um, it pretty much came up with all these uh, different um, iOS Jailbreak Zone videos. Um, these are pretty much my Temple Run, uh, Zeppelin, uh, Siri, and all the other videos. Uh, um, this tweak pretty much fetched all the results from YouTube. It does also support the App Store, iTunes Store um, and a couple of other places which I'm going to show you right now. Uh, let me just um, scroll down. So guys, as you can see it does support YouTube, Weather, App Store, Stocks, iTunes Store, Maps and even Cydia. So let's just uh, try something, uh, something else. So if we search for Temple Run as you can see, it's inside of Cydia, and if we just uh, search for it, as you can see, it's also available in the iTunes Store, and there's also a location. Don't know where that will take you, but anyways, um, there there are also um, results from the stock application, uh, the App Store, and even the um, YouTube uh, results from Touch Gameplay and other other um, users. So it's a pretty uh, awesome tweak, guys, and it's really useful, and you can pretty much. Uh, utilize your spotlight search and while we're also on the topic let's check out our next tweak which is taskmaster it's a pretty amazing tweak it gives you all these toggles inside of your spotlight search um, again if you don't use your spotlight search that much this will pretty much uh, make it a whole lot better um, as you can see it does have all these little toggles you can change your brightness which um, era doesn't let you do unfortunately um, and you can also uh, turn up your volume you can pretty much uh, update your status on Facebook, Twitter, uh, you can compose new text and you can even have a look at um, your device's status like how much storage is left, um, the battery percentage and uh, and a couple of other things. Alright guys, so uh, let's go to the next one. Alright guys, so next up we have status HUD or status HUD and this uh, tweak pretty much lets you um, change your um, volume HUD into the status bar so if you don't understand what I mean just look at this whenever I turn up or down my volume um, it pretty much comes up with this little quite annoying um, kind of sign and um, once I enable status HUD uh, notice my status bar it's pretty much indicating um, how high my volume is um, there is also a setting with, where you can change it to a square so as you can see now um, my volume indicator is pretty much in square icons so it's just a uh, simple tweak but it's quite useful if you find the little uh, volume HUD uh, annoying so um, that, that's pretty much it for this tweak and now for the last tweak of the week and for the theme of the week um, we're gonna be looking at iOS 7 theme 
this is pretty much the whole package there are two um, two tweaks inside of CDI actually uh, just have a look at both of them um, the iOS 7 theme actually comes with a lot of different things uh, let's just uh, show you what it comes with um, what is supported if you go into that it supports app icons so it'll pretty much uh, show you all the uh, different iOS 7 icons, signal bars, wallpapers, batteries, uh, UI of settings, UI of messages, byte SMS, uh, user interface of phone, WhatsApp, notes, Safari, music and a whole lot of other stuff. Um, I probably don't use all of that but if you go into Winterboard uh, as you can see you can even enable it for Vlogs, Siri, uh, for the phone application um, and even OXO and that so it does support a few CDA tweaks as well. Uh, I don't actually have any of them installed right now so I can't show you but if I go in into my lock screen actually um, as you can see uh, due to the fact that I do have ARA installed you can't see but uh, it's pretty much like the iOS 7 uh, lock screen and if I go into the folders as you can see it's pretty cool uh, if I go into the notification center as you can see it's um, blurred out like blurry NC background but it's like um, kind of darker and um, as you can see it's pretty cool and you can also uh, have a look at the transparent effect and um, if you actually look at it this tweak has been updated to support uh, a few other icons like winterboard and that and um, it's pretty amazing uh, how much uh, customizations it actually comes with if I actually go into the messages app um, you'll be able to see that it does customize that it's pretty much part of the iOS 7 user interface and I can write So as you can see guys, the messages application is themed and if I actually go into another one, uh, say for example calculator, it does actually theme that as well. So let's just try this. So as you can see it's pretty cool guys, um, it pretty much themes a lot of things unlike a lot of the other themes that are out there inside of uh, Cydia. It's pretty, pretty much the best iOS 7 theme that you can get right now. So while you can get it, just jump into Cydia and grab it because uh, if you don't like the laggy, uh, buggy, I, I have heard that the iOS 7 betas are quite smooth, but still, if you don't want to install that beta, then just jump into Cydia and download this tweak. Alright guys, that will pretty much wrap it up this video. Um, if you enjoyed the tweaks, please give this video a thumbs up. It does help me out uh, a ton and it does also help me know uh, if you li like the tweaks or not. And if you'd like to see more great videos like this, then definitely be sure to hit subscribe because then you'll be notified every time I upload great videos like this. So thanks again for watching guys and I'll catch you guys in the next one.